and to you, to us and is loved in Lebanon. It's very important. He uh, sent that to uh, Uba, uh, Uma Abedin, who works with Hillary. It's Jeff Feltman, she writes back. I'm sure he knows him. I'll talk to Jeff. Then Doug writes her back, says, better if you call him. Now preferable. This is very important. So let me get this straight. We have a big donor who is really good friends with Bill Clinton. He gives money to the Families Foundation. And then folks over in the State Department who work for the government, where Hillary Clinton is the Secretary of State, she's going to give that guy a favor because he gave money to her Families Foundation. Is, that eth is, is it beyond unethical? Is it dangerous? It is dangerous. Um, it's the kind of thing that's worthy of a serious investigation. And when he said it's important, he didn't mean it was important to the United States. He meant it was important to the foundation, which is a private entity. And the Secretary of State cannot be using the power of that office uh, and uh, to subordinate national interest to the foundation interest. So I think that is a serious problem. And who knows what else would be in some of these emails that have not yet been uh, disclosed. So these were the emails that had been suppressed, held back, not released, and, and just now coming to light. Well, Senator, many people are saying, I mean, DOJ's not even going to investigate. The FBI wants to. Many people are just saying she's going to get a pass. This is just one more thing that she's going to get away with. A lot of people are unhappy with this. What does Donald Trump need to do to combat the mainstream media and Hillary Clinton? Well, I think he needs to continue to talk about uh, this issue and her integrity and leadership ability. But actually, he needs to also move forward on the great issues that he raised about the economy on Monday. That was a fabulous speech, laying out a plan that will actually increase growth and productivity in America, help wages rise instead of fall. They fell again second quarter. Wages for Americans, it's down $4,000 median income in America since 2000. The, the, the people of this country are hurting. They're not angry because they're just irritable. They're angry because systemically things have not gone well. It's time for this government to respond. We need a change, and Donald Trump has got the right ideas and can make this country better.